Alright, so it looks like The Nun 2 is finally going into production. <laughs> They were just waiting for James Wan to wrap up filming on Aquaman 2. They're going back as a producer for The Nun 2. Honestly, I think James Wan is better directing The Nun 2 instead of being producer. I did enjoy the first movie, so I didn't review it. They've got uh, your guy, Michael Chavez. Michael Chavez, I'm not sure how he pronounces his name. He's directing The Nun 2. Uh, he also directed uh, The Curse of La Llorada, and he directed The Conjuring 3. Curse of La Rada, I think, you know, had some really good, clever jump scares. It was a fun movie to watch. It wasn't brilliant, but it was interesting. The concept was interesting, and I did like it. The Conjuring 3, after watching The Curse of La Rada, I, you know, expected it to be on the same level as The Curse of La Rada, and um, wasn't wrong. But that being said, you know, what made up for the movie was just seeing Patrick Wilson and Vera Farmiga. Uh, the third movie, I wouldn't say it was bad, but the first two were a lot better. They were. James Wan should have directed the third movie. I think he was doing Aquaman. He just wanted to be, I think he, he doesn't really want to make, direct as many horror films these days, but he could make an one. He made Malignant. I mean, The Conjuring 3 wasn't bad. It was really fun to watch. So, uh, yeah, I will totally go see The Nun too. And they've got your girl Bonnie Irons, is it? I'm not sure. Bonnie something. She's coming back to play The Nun again. Where are the time then The Nun 2 will be set? I don't know. Will it be a sequel? Will it be a prequel? But, you know, they've left uh, The Nun open where they could literally just pick up where the first one ended. I wonder what it'd be to do with Frenchie, because Frenchie has the mark. Uh, I'd say Ed Lorraine, Patrick Wilson and Vera Famiga, Ed and Lorraine Warren, they probably will reprise their roles for the Nun 2, considering this would probably be about Frenchie and how, you know, he meets up with them and the exorcist Balak from him. So I wonder, will, um, or, Will it just be the nun in a totally different setting, different time period, doing something else, harassing other people? I don't know. Or maybe it could be an actual origin, origin story, right where Balak proper came from. I think, like, we're gonna get to see Balak again. Apparently, I don't know when they say his name, but they say his name in the movie. They're back, they're still alive. You know, fuck that. Ugh. Needed that. Cup of tea with sugar.